All right. Yes, Larry. Time for the list. Kids are back to school. Uh, how about some fun animal facts uh, to enjoy around the Whoa. kitchen table this right. evening? First up. Wait, is that conducive to kids being back at school? I don't understand the connection. It's information. It's yeah. learning. Oh, but they're in school now. Well, but their parents will record this episode. Oh, yeah. and oh they I'm get sorry. dinner tonight. I didn't know I should be doing that. We still get credit within yeah. 24 hours <laughs> yeah. if they watch the DVR. Yeah. Okay, got It's it. a great tradition My that some apologies. of their families have. Okay. Uh, first up, Looney Tunes would have you believe that the coyote was too slow to catch the Roadrunner. But in fact, coyotes outpace Roadrunners by 23 miles per hour. Really? You'd think the genius Wiley would have known that. So uh, put down the Acme catalog there and start running. Hmm. Next up, lobsters. Their bladders are beneath their brain, and oh. they can urinate from their head up to seven feet. What? Ah. That is like the world's worst superpower. <laughs> <laughs> Lobster men, stand back. <laughs> wow, good for them. Yeah, sure. Who knew? All right. uh, next up, cicadas. Uh, sometimes uh, swarm people using lawnmowers. Why? Because they confuse the roar of power tools <gasps> For oh. mating calls. Oh, I had a brother who had that same thing. He'd yeah. hear uh, someone working in the garage, he'd go crazy. He had to keep him on a leash. Yeah. <laughs> That's interesting. It's a sexy sound. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Don't even get me going on the snowblower. <laughs> Thankfully, yeah. that's in the winter months. Right, right. That's the downside. Yeah. yeah. Uh, next up in Queensland, Australia, it's illegal to own a pet for rabbit unless you're a magician. Oh, oh that's fair. Fair. Why do magicians use them? Well, the white rabbits contrast well against black tuxedos, and as most of their sizes fur, they're very compressible, making oh. it easy to fit them in that black top hat. Or in a sleeve or wherever it yeah. is that you need to pull them out of. Yeah. I love magicians. Uh, They're the best. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, you know what we should do for you? You should get you a magician with bare feet. Like that would yeah, really put you over the edge, <laughs> right? That's a great it's idea. It's like the two And he's far. wearing panties. Stop. Yes. Stop it. Stop. Uh, next up, slugs have four noses. Uh, actually, slug scientists say technically slugs have four tentacles, which they use to see and smell. Good How about them. that? Yeah. Uh, next up, trained pigeons can differentiate between the paintings of Picasso and Monet, which is really not that big of a deal when you think about it. One's no. Cubist, the other's an Impressionist. That they're pretty easy to distinguish yeah. between one and the other. How do they ask how, yeah. how did they... What do they say? Which one's the... Well, in case you know you need one delivered, then you tra train the pigeon, make, make sure to deliver the right one. Right. You know, those carrier pigeons, that's yeah. what they're training. Yeah. 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 Next, the wood frog can hold its urine for up to eight months. What? They recycle it into nitrogen to keep them alive while they hibernate in the winter. Two great urine stories yes, here. Yes, in the <laughs> same list. Interesting. Science. He doesn't mind the urine stories, no, but he poop. despises yeah, the... Yeah, the poop stories. Yeah. <laughs> it depends on the context. He's the number one guy. Yeah. He is always number one. <laughs> That's right. Always, Much to Channel 7's chagrin, yeah. <laughs> they'll Not never beat us. He's always be a number one, yeah. not right. number two. And we are at number one, <laughs> come to think right. of it, as we count down our list of fun animal facts. You know, in the 1880s, a baboon worked as a signal man for nine years on a South African railroad. He was paid in brandy and never made a mistake. Really? His owner was a signal man until he had an accident and couldn't perform his duty, so he trained the baboon. We're not doing enough with baboons and animals and helping, you know. They're sitting around bored in the zoo. Doing nothing. Horses are the worst example of it, but they have so much more potential and we're settling for yeah. them sitting around. We're Think down a producer. We we're could. Down, right? <laughs> a writer or two. We could set up a valet out here for God's sakes but just think how fun it would be to come into work yeah. and your keys off to a baboon <laughs> and then you come so, on in and then you come yeah. out and you're like hey Mr. Baboon where'd you park the car I'll go yeah. get it for you there's so many things they could be doing yeah anyway that's the list I hope you kids enjoy it that was great Go ahead.